J.C. Smith, a professor at the University of Colorado Boulder, reveals information about the evolution of flowering plants and petal modification. This year, the University of Tennessee hosts their 20th Darwin Day celebrations. Smith's lecture, Beg, Borrow, and Steal, The Nefarious History of Flower Power, takes place on UT's campus in the James R. Cox Auditorium Alumni Building. Smith presents the relationship between species and evolution through a tree-like structure that Charles Darwin proposed. Um, it's also worth noting that the only figure in the origin of species was um, a phylogenetic tree, uh, shown here on the right. And so um, it's important to remember that Darwin was not the first biologist to use trees in the context of showing relationships among species, but typically these were used to depict classifications. Smith's research area is in flowers and the colored plastid chromoplast that is typically red or orange. My research has been trying to figure out how you switch flower colors. Currently, we are trying to understand biochemically how does it happen, Smith said. 